Hey everyone, welcome to the video. Hope you enjoy what you see. I'm actually down on the lot and again, I was here last night and it looked like the water was rising a little bit. So I thought I'd come back in the morning. Whoa, there's a huge spider right there. I'm not sure if you can see it. it almost walks straight into that. Just looking at the ground instead of up. There we are. All right, so I was here last night and it looked like the water was rising. So I thought I'd come back in the morning to flick up into some rapids and I'd throw out a bait rod as well. So I've got that here with some yabbies. I'm not sure if you've seen the video I did a while ago, catching some yabbies. Well, here we are with the yabbies. See if we can get some. Now I'm just gonna have a quick look down here to see how much this water's actually risen overnight if it has. And by the looks of it, that's slightly. Look, I'm not gonna say it's risen a lot, but this section here has probably gotten about five centimeters more depth by looking at the rocks, the top of the rocks here. All right, I'm gonna turn this head torch off so I stop scaring some fish. I'm not sure how much you can see now, but I can see plenty. Let's try to catch some big fellas. Yes, I want, not one. Just a little cod, I think. There we are, little fella. He's only a baby. Beautiful. All right, let's get this little fella out. <laughs> Come back here, mate. Just gotta put my rod somewhere, buddy. Over there. That looks good. Let's deal with you. Ooh. You only just got pinned there, mate. Only just. You must have been really aggressively trying to take that one. Oh, look at that. Little beauty. All right, I'll let you go. I'll find the bigger ones. See you later, fella. It's usually where you're finding them sometimes this early morning is just places where food is going to be vulnerable so if there's any food coming down this rapid here those cod are just going to munch them up in that fast water because they're the food are disorientated you know your little bait carps and stuff as they're coming down they are just disorientated in that fast water the cod are much bigger more powerful they can sit in the fast water without a worry and they just gobble them up where you cast it yeah Oh, did ya? Photos though, it wasn't true. Oh no. The reel just went in. <laughs> Go on. I got a little cod, I think. Yeah, a little cod. Swing Mikey. Come on, boy. Up you come. Wow. Beauty. Little angry guy. <laughs> See you later, fella. You can go on this side so you don't get caught again. Ready? Maybe I need to dive a deeper. Get a diver on there. Oh, throw it out there. There's fish activity. That was a hit. Felt like a Murray Cod hit to me. That was a whack. That was like a hey. Damn it. Got one. Oh. 
feels good. Maybe. Felt good for a second. Maybe it was just a like a little cod going underneath. Oh, she's a good size cod. Alright. It's that fast water. Makes them feel a bit bigger than they are, I reckon. What a lovely guy. Whoa! Come back here, you. So that fast pulse and retrieve and stop him helped out. He's just hooked it under the under the mouth there. Since this cod's been a bit lively, we gotta be careful here. Look at you. Aren't you a beautiful looking specimen? Really dark, lots of good green on this one. Look at that. Wow. Beautiful. Beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Oh, wow. Very dark. It's almost got blue on it, this one. Wow, very beautiful fish. Look at you. You're probably the most beautiful looking cod I've caught in a long time. You've got blue on you. That is incredible. I don't know if you can see that in the camera, but it's just maybe the light. It just looks blue. It's the most beautiful cod I've seen in a long time. The blues on this is are incredible. Now when I put this fella back in the water, I expect he's just gonna wanna run. So the, let's see how we go. We're just gonna easily ease him in. Ease him in. He's gonna wet me. Go into the depths a bit. There you go. Oh, see you later, fella. He's right there. He's not in a rush to go. Look at that. What a magnificent specimen. Oh. Throw me a like for that one. Let's check and move this bait rod a little bit. I can feel the abbey still in there. Look at the angle that that's going down. It is just a deep hole. It's like you're fishing off a pier at the ocean. Move it into here, Mike. We got pushed over a lot. Let's see if we can brace it so it can go straight again. Oh. And so people stop pushing it over. There you go. You might have a good chance of growing now, buddy. Straight up, people are gonna stop pushing you around. Lean Care Kev, that's my other YouTube channel. Jokes. I don't have that much time. Oh, yes. Got one. Weight's fighting, feels like a carp. It's come up to the surface already. Yep, she's a big one. <laughs> I was just using yabby tails. Let's get it up. Let's get it up. In comes the monster. Woo! <laughs> Bring that one up. There we go. Catch number one for the day. I was actually saying to myself, I'm going home. 
<laughs> I packed up the other rod. I was coming over to pack this one up. Alrighty then. It's not a bad size carp either. I'd probably say that one's about 65 centimeters. Big and chunky. 